Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In the previous video, we have completed sign up part of Cafe Management System project. If you are not seen that video, just go to description and check out the link. In this video, we are going to work on forget password part. So let us start with that. Let me open the VS code and my backend is already running. So now first we have to go to the services and we have to go to the user services. And here we have to just copy paste this method first and we have to just change the name to forgot password and we also need to change it over here forgot password and just save this so so this will be the post method and the header type will be content type application slash json so now we have to generate a forget password components right click on this folder app folder and open integrated terminal and here we have to write ng generate component forgot password and press enter so it will generate a component for us and it will also update the app module as a new component will be created so we have to just wait for a few seconds sometime our component has been generated so now now first we have to connect this component with our home page this page so here we are going to create a button over here and when we click on that it should open that model or dialog so we have to move to the home component.ts file over here and we have to just copy paste this one and here we have to just change this to sign up to forward password action this one and uh, after that here we also need to change this one to forget this one forget password component we need to import and we are importing it from this place and once uh, this one import just copy the this method name and just go to the html of this one and after that over here we have to write like this a click and here we have to write like this and forgot password we have to write like this and save this one it will build successfully here you can see the button if i click on this you can see the forget password box it means that we are able to connect that new component with this home page so now we have to write the codes to uh, like and forms related to the forget password so now we have to move to the forget password ts file over here and first we need to create the form so here we have to write for got password form and it should be any type and form group we need to import this one from here angular form from here we have to import that and after that response message variable we are going to create and in constructor we are going to import few things form builder we need so form builder and the next will be user services user service so user service we imported from here and let me scroll a little down and after that public and dialog reference and mat dialog reference this one and in this we have to pass the forget password component mat dialog reference we have imported it from this place angular material dialog and we also imported it from forget password after that private ngx service and ngx ui loader service we need to import this one and private snack bar service snack bar service this one so all the uh, like required services we imported over here now we have to create the form so inside of this one we have to write this dot forgot password form is equals to 
this dot form builder and dot we have to group and inside this we have to declare what are the fields we require so email field sign e over here and that should be of null type and validators this one dot required and we also need to validate the pattern so pattern as you already know that we are going to validate the pattern from global constant dot email rejects this one and we have imported it from global constant over here and all others ng UI you can see from here okay so but this one is completed now if someone hits the like api submit button so in that case we need to handle hit our uh, service so just handle submit and in this we are going to start the loader we're going to start the loader and then we are going to form data and this dot forward password form dot value and where data and in this email is form data dot email this dot user services dot forward password and in this we are going to pass the data dot subscribe response if any and in this this dot ngx service dot stop this dot response message whatever the message we are going to receive we are going to pass it over here and this dot dialog reference dot we need to close that one if we get the successful response and this dot snack bar service dot open snack bar and this dot response message whatever we get we are going to pass and in this one we are going to display the message and if any error occur in that case we also need to display so error here we need to write like this let me scroll a little up this dot ngx service dot stop and if error dot error question mark dot message message then we need to display this dot response message is equals to we have to just copy paste this one part paste it over here and in else condition we have to pass the generic error global constant dot generic error and we need to display the error message so open the snack bar and this dot response message and global constant dot error we need to pass this one just save this one now we have to go to the css part of this one page and here we have to write few lines of the code for css so mat toolbar and margin 24px and margin bottom 10px and width auto and for the mat form field we need padding of 5px just save this now we have to go to the forget password page and here we have to write the code for html part of this page so mat toolbar and color should be primary let's close this one mat toolbar raw fx layout and here we have to write raw and span forward password 
question mark and here we have to write span and here we have to write class spacer and inside this we have to put the button to close this particular dialog so in this we have to write class mat dialog close mat icon button mat dialog close and here we have to write mat icon and here we have to write close let's save this and let's check it out uh, how it looks so you can see forget password if i click on close it will close it that form let's get back over here again now we have to create the form so here we have to go to the next line and here we have to write mat dialog content and we have to use the class mat typography and we have to close this one and here we have to create the form form tag and form group and for good password form and inside this we have to write here div fx flex fx layout and here we have to write column and inside this we have to write mat form we have to create the form field form field and appearance let's close this one tag first and here we have to write a standard and after that here we have to write fx flex and here we have to declare a right label so the label should be email type and after that we have to write input mat input form control name and that will be email and it should be required field and you also need to put some validations let me write it over here so mat error this one and here we have to write ng if in double quotes and here we have to write forward password form dot controls controls dot email dot touched and form dot controls dot email dot invalid so in that case we need to display the error and here we have to write span star ng if is equals to and forward password dot controls dot email dot error errors dot required in this case we have to this field is mandatory and in the same way for the pattern we have to display so star ng if forgot password dot controls dot email dot errors dot pattern pattern and this field is invalid we need to display this error and after that we have to also add some buttons so that whenever user is able to click on submit and all so for that we have to write here mat dialog actions and align should be end and inside this one we have to create the button and here's mat 
raised button and the color primary and the type will be submit on click event handle submit we have to call this method whenever someone click on this one and we also need to disable uh, this button in some conditions it's not form this one dot valid and for form dot dirty these two conditions and inside this inside this button we have to display a mat icon with some text so mat icon and here we have to write send put little space over here and here send password this one after that we also need to add one more button to so close this dialog so button mat raised button and here we have to write color so warn and mat dialog dot close and here we have to write mat icon and cancel and here we have to write close so our form is ready let's save this and let's check it out how it looks so i'm going to forget, click on forget password here you can see let's check out the validation so you can see this field is mandatory and if i write something wrong so you can see this field is invalid there is one extra space i can see over here so just remove that one save it and get back over here and so let's uh, open the database i have it added one more mail over here you can see so just copy paste this one and uh, let's get back over here and let's paste that email address over here and let's check out to send the mail password so you can see the loader is visible it means it's working fine it's working to send the mail so you can see check your mail for credentials so i'm going to on my public email address and from here you can see i received the email over here you can see your login credentials detail you can see the email address you can see the password you can see the link to open that particular site so it means that forget password working as expected so this is all about forget passwords in upcoming videos we are going to talk more about this project so let's stay tuned with us please hit like and subscribe my channel thank you